Now let us check for the story displacement. So I have prepared that in Excel sheet also. Allowable ratio is 0 0.025 for the ultimate limit state and for serviceability limit state it is 0 0.006 and allowable displacement is computed by this formula that is 0 0.025 basically this is the allowable ratio into height of the building divided by ductility factor. So I have already explained these terms in the first video you can check there. So according to that the allowable displacement is 179 mm. Now let us check the uh, displacement in ultimate limit state in E tabs. So go to display force or stress diagram story response plot. Here you will find maximum story displacement and we will check this for EQX ultimate limit state. So it is 112.54 which is okay because allowable is 179. Similarly you can check this for EQ Y ultimate limit state it is 120. So this is for Y direction and it is also okay. Now in serviceability limit state Hundred eight, hundred fifteen. It is okay. So for allowable displacement in SLS, we will divide this by RS. Okay. Similarly, we have to check for drift, and for drift allowable ratio is zero point zero two five. And dividing this by R that is the ductility factor for ultimate limit state it comes as 0 0.01 let us check the drift for EQX ultimate limit state it is 0 0.005 0 0.005 0 .005. it is okay Similarly, in y direction, it is 0 0.005, it is also okay. And in serviceability limit state, the drift shall be less than 0 0.006 in either direction, which is true for now. Zero point zero zero five nine. Okay, so drift criteria and displacement criteria is done. I hope this video helped you and if it did help do like and comment in the uh, comment box below and subscribe our channel.